How do you say that? D-U-E-R-S-T. Did you remember Durst is the worst? Ah! Durst the worst, bitch! <laughs> Durst the worst, bitch! Durst the worst, bitch! Durst the worst, bitch! I was just wondering, who is the more conservative view on abortion? Do you think you or Margaret Sanger? Because it would seem that your view is much more radical than hers. You said that if there's a beaker of fetuses or an infant child, you'd save the infant child. Her position is that an Estonian fetus is worth more than, say, a Saudi fetus. Um, how do you sort of explain your position relative to hers and relative uh, to uh, saving a infant child over a beaker full of fetuses? I guess I'm a little confused by the question. Uh, I, Margaret Sanger has a conservative view on abortion. That's the first time I've heard her describe it. Well, she, she wanted to use it as a eugenics tool. Yeah, to, right, right. She's, right. She's, I, to, to create a more higher endowed mean IQ for the country and Yes. For Western societies. Well, that's absolutely true. That's a good point that we should emphasize more and more that Margaret Sanger, the founder of Planned Parenthood, was a eugenicist, as you point out. Um, but I guess I just don't see the co co connection between that and, uh, and my position. Um, well, I mean, I guess if you look at countries that have banned abortion, they tend not to be the most technologically advanced. Right. So she wanted to use it as a tool to say, you know, maybe elevate the U.S.'s mean psychometric score to comparable to like Estonia's or Finland's or Switzerland's or Taiwan's or South Korea's. And the end result, perhaps, of, of making abortion illegal is to have a society more like Saudi Arabia, Iran, the United Arab Emirates, or Brazil, or Nicaragua. That there's sort of, objectively, when one looks at the choices being made, societies in which abortion is a choice have lower rates of crime and higher levels of psychometric uh, performance. So does that make your view maybe more radical than hers? Sure, if you, if you, I mean, I, I, whatever you want to call it, it's, it's the morally correct position, and I certainly don't think that, I don't know if you're getting at some sort of socioeconomic argument for abortion here. No, but if you end up in a society where there's more violent crime, more rape and more murder like there is in Nicaragua, it, maybe it isn't more moral. I mean, it's just, it's just an argument. I just want to know what your position was. Okay, I see what you're getting around. I think I see what you're getting around to. We finally got there. I saw, I'm still thrown off by the mosaic thing. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> I, had no, I didn't play any role in that. Uh, what I would say is using uh, murder as a tool to bring down the crime rate or to alleviate poverty is a horrific uh, moral abomination and that every society that has done it, it has ended in uh, catastrophe. So even if you could prove, and you hear this argument a lot, that well, hey, um, if you have more abortion and it helps socioeconomically, there's less poverty. I don't know if I agree with that, but it's also irrelevant because you can never adjust, you can never justify murder on those grounds or on any grounds. And if you were to say to me that if we don't kill babies, we'll be a poor country, and even if you could show me a crystal ball that proves it, I would say, okay, let's be a poor country uh, because I would rather be a poor country that doesn't kill babies than a rich one that does. Um, so that's that's the way I, I look at that. Um, and the last thing I'll say is, you, know, you, you could make an argument that uh, you could make an argument that uh, you know go eradicate the homeless people, um, go you know go to the inner city and, and kill everybody. Maybe that will help the economy. Maybe it will. I mean, maybe, maybe if, you, if you kill everyone that's unemployed, then you get rid of the unemployment problem, don't you? Um, but of course, nobody would nobody would agree to that because it's just it's, a, it's morally despicable and horrific. So I would say the same thing. With Start the way. Okay. Try, bitch!